Okay, in this video, we're going to learn how to find asymptotes on the graphing calculator. So the question asks us here, which of the following lines are asymptotes of the graph of y equals 1 plus x over x? And there's three choices here. Um, so what we want to do first is go to y equals, and we will put um, our equation in. So we have, careful with our parentheses, we have 1 plus x, close the parentheses, divided by x, enter that, and let's graph it by hitting diamond F3. And we can see the graph here, and this makes it pretty clear um, <clears throat> where our vertical asymptote is. We can probably see that um, uh, as uh, at x equals 0, we probably have a vertical asymptote. So if we want, we can zoom out just to be a little bit more sure. And you can definitely see that it's going towards zero. Um, and if we have any doubts, we can hit F3 to trace. And as we trace, we can start with, say, at x equals 1, where we're over here. And as we go to the left, we can see x gets smaller and y goes to infinity, where actually at x equals 0, there is no y value. Um, so definitely, for starters, we know there is an asymptote, a vertical asymptote at x equals 0. OK, next. Um, we can see that it looks like there's a horizontal asymptote at around y equals 1. Uh, and again, we can use our trace function here. So if we try hitting F3 for our trace button, um, we can see if we start here, as we go more and more to the left, we can see that the y value is going to approach 1, but it's never quite going to hit 1. Similarly, if we start on the other side and we say, let's plug in, say, x equals 5, we can see that y, again, is going to go down from 1.2, and it's going to approach 1, but it will never hit 1. So therefore, we can tell that there is also an asymptote at y equals 1. So the answers are Roman numeral 1, which is x equals 0, and Roman numeral 3, which is y equals 1, which would be choice D as our correct answer.